how to stay safe tonight. Yeah, Craig and Megan, the Jean Leahy Mall area right now is currently dead. That's because the planned fireworks show has been postponed until Saturday. Uh, organizers postponed the event because they were concerned about 30 mile per hour wind gusts that are expected to hit the Omaha Metro. And they, those same wind gusts are expected to make Omaha bitterly cold tonight, which is going to make things problematic for all those that go out to various bars to ring in the new year. For those looking to hit the bars celebrating the end of 2018, be prepared to bundle up. Temperatures will likely be somewhere in the teens throughout the night with heavy winds dropping the wind chill to well below zero. Three News Now meteorologist Ryan McPike says being out too long may actually be a bit risky. It becomes almost a danger thing on top of just being really uncomfortable. The biggest danger? Frostbite. The actual frostbite is an injury to the skin where it's numb and um, you know actually the color of the skin can change to kind of a yellowy color. Frostbite can result in fatigue, confusion, and loss in coordination, which means bar goers may not recognize the symptoms. Instead, thinking they're just buzzed. It makes you less aware of, of what's happening to you. And, you know, if you're with someone who's like a designated driver, I would just watch out for other people. If you notice signs of frostbite in someone else, I would say something. If you're concerned someone you're celebrating with may have frostbite, it's important to first get them into a warm room and then look for any blue or yellow discolored skin. After that, immerse the area in a lukewarm bath. But staying indoors is the best way to avoid any trouble. But if you do go out, layer up. You really want to, you know, watch the extremities bundle up the, you know, keep the face covered, the nose, the ears, that kind of thing, the fingers, toes, uh, those kind of go first. And now if this feels like something that we have been through relatively recently, it has been. On last year's New Year's Eve, the issue was bitterly cold temperatures. Now this year, temps are a little bit higher, but winds are much stronger. In downtown Omaha, John Kipper, 3 News Now. If you're planning to go out and party 